What up YouTube, this is GeoStealth R1 and this is my Rustler VXL application. Um, initially I was going to be selling this car but uh, a lot of people have convinced me uh, to keep it. I uh, tried to sell it, a uh, person I bought it from uh, wasn't able to pay for it so I don't know if it was uh, the act by the gods or, or, or whatever but anyway a lot of people have been asking me uh, a few questions about this car, and I uh, just thought I should address them right now. Um, first question was, you know, what do I get the decals from? You know, um, the decals, talking about all the decals that are set up on this car. And the answer is right there. Uh, the company's called Upgrade RC. Um, they pretty much have everything you could do for your RC car if you want to decal it out uh, if you want to decal your controller um, they have a section on that if you want to get custom decals with your name on it yeah um, they they also do have um, pit mats uh, a large variety of colors that they have over there um, other than that, that's 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 primarily it. Uh, second question: uh, What type of bumpers do I have, and uh, how come if everything on my car is RPM, how come I never went with the RPM bumpers? Uh, good question, and I'll give you a good answer. Uh, over here, uh, I have my uh, T-bone T-bone racing bumpers. Um, by far, uh, most of my cars have them. Uh, I have it on my Rustler Marvel Monster. I'm pretty sure you guys have seen it. It's in orange. Uh, I'm waiting to get another set for my Grave Digger, which will definitely be in green. And uh, on this, uh, I have black carbon fiber. I'm going to change it out to red carbon fiber very soon. But um, I have it there on the front. I have it there on the rear. Now, a lot of people have asked me, you know, are these even good bumpers and stuff like that? And, you know, trust me, I I, I, I beat the crap out of them. Um, never have any issue. As you can see, they do protect the engine on my car. Yeah, usually you guys don't get to see the underbelly of my, of my rustlers, but yeah, that's it. <sighs> Uh, other questions that I've been having uh, internally with my car. So let me crack the hood open and just go over a few things um, with my Rustler. Okay, uh, I still have the same battery I was going to sell the car on. But um, yeah, people have been asking me about the mesh, the mesh you can find on eBay. Um, TechFlex, I believe, is called. Um, it's it's just expandable wire for your um for your wiring you know i think it makes it look a lot neater you know uh, my opinion you know i think it definitely gives it a little bit more of a more of a custom feel you know it it just it just looks like it belongs on the car so um you know in, in this rc game you know we've all been you know, doing a lot of things to upgrade our rcs so you know why not do something like that to make your rc look you know, proper. Um, another thing people have been asking me is, you know, I mean, it's, it's all about custom customizing your car. Um, shock socks. Now, my shock socks, um, it's it, they come in variety of colors. You're looking uh, roughly around four dollars for the shocks, shock socks, and one dollar for shipping, so five dollars altogether. Uh, Aesthetically, they, they look awesome on the car, you know, give it a little splash of whatever color car you have. Um, yeah, you can find that on eBay. Um, definitely a good price to get. Just type in uh, Rustler Shock Socks or Slash Shock Socks. You're going to notice the guy, he, he, he sells them very inexpensive, so you can't go wrong with that. Uh, people have asked me about my shock covers. Uh, white shock covers from uh, RPM. They're they're relatively easy to install. Uh, they come with the cover and they come with the the bottom of the of the sh uh, of the shock holder. So you're able to uh, 
to install it relatively with ease. Um, you're looking at a set of four. I think it's like 12 bucks or something. I'm not too sure. I don't even have the card on me. It's in my box. Um, another question people have been asking me is, you know, where... Where where did I get these um, these these toe arms, and um, also by RPM uh, the 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 inserts uh, right in the middle that's from Traxxas that's the red, and I saw the white. Um, I thought to myself, you know what? No one has that. You know, I've seen I've I've heard about people dyeing them and stuff like that, but they definitely give it something you know, uh, something different, you know, something totally, totally not the norm. And if you're looking to get that, even if you're not into the white, these are dyeable parts, you know, so if you wanted to dye them any other color that you want, you know, why not? You know, it's, it's there, you have it relatively, you know, accessible, you get the dye, the powder dye, and, you know, you dip it in there and you're good to go. Um, what are the questions people have been asking me? Oh, another question that has been asked is, what is my future with this car? What are my plans to do with it? Uh, am I keeping it? Is, is this going to stay within the family? Um, yeah, I, th I think at, at this point, you know, um, I should keep it. I spoke with Ace. Ace was like, yo, get rid of the car, keep the body. You know, so you, know, <laughs> you think about scenarios like that. I mean, it it is an expensive uh, hobby that that we're in. Expensive for me because I'm I'm trying to you know keeping up with the Joneses and stuff like that with the other stuff that I have. But um, yeah, man. Uh, I, I think for now uh, it will stay in the stable. Uh, as for the future, I'm not too sure. But um, yeah. Uh, if if you like this video, rate, comment, subscribe. Uh, I do do a lot of other videos with my cars and updates and how to customize parts. Any questions, uh, I'll be able to give an answer for you. If I don't have the answer, I'll directly to the person that would have the answer for you. Um, oh, uh, last question um, that somebody asks. Will I ever make this a Mamba Monster Wrestler? Uh, this car, uh, no. Uh, to me, this car was mostly... if. If I was able to throw it into water because of the the Valenian engine and the 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 VXL ESC and you know everything is waterproof on this, so uh, for me to, to to even attempt to make this uh, a mob monster, eesh, you know I I I prefer not to, you know I, I I have one car that does that that I'm very happy with that. Don't get me wrong, if something did happen to my Mamba Monster, I'd, I'd probably siphon parts off of this, but, you know, it, it is what it is. But anyway, uh, fellas out of YouTube, uh, thank you very much for uh, hanging in there and checking out this video. And uh, like I said, rate, comment, subscribe, and I'll be hitting you up with other videos. Take it easy. Later.